to Rene. May go 60 or treble 16. Once 88, now double 14. He's starting to think about it. It was a good dart. Can he rescue it, Michael Van Gerwen? Treble 20. No, he can't. No, he can't. So Ivan's here to force a tiebreak. Changing. Double four now. That is absolutely incredible. Finally, get the job done. Well, he does go that way for 90. Double 12. That is a win for Michael Van Gerwen. Michael Van Gerwen beats Rene Adams by three sets to two. But that doesn't tell you half the story. What a match! Biggest win of his life. Double 12. This the night, a new starting star is born. Jamie Lewis has beaten the world number two, Peter Wright, with a quite astonishing display. He has never, ever played as well as that in his entire life. For the title. 25, 86 left. Double eight. Yes! It's young star is in the crowd, he's gone to Ivanka, his inspiration of darts, but what a performance, Raymond Barnival sacks for a dream. 19 20. there, left 166. Six. He's got six darts, yeah. he's got six Marker. darts. 60. Oh, Phil Taylor is going to face match point. Well, he's going to get at least two darts at tops. Aidan Kirk is on the cusp of one of the biggest upsets in the modern era of the sport of darts. Philip Taylor, out of 60. sorts, out of touch, off form, the five times winner of the UK Open. Tops for Aidan Kirk to beat Philip Taylor in the UK Open in my head. Incredible, amazing. Would you believe that? 22 years of age, a total unknown, an hour or so ago for many. But now he will be on the lips of millions of sports fans around the world because Aidan Kirk has beaten Philip Taylor at the UK Open. The world's best darts and Vinan Havenga for tops for the match. Shock result on the cards. Tens now for Havenga. Can he finish it off here? Yes, he can! Vinan Havenga of South Africa! 41 years old, unknown going into this tournament, has put out Peter Manley. Match starts 3, 4 and 5 for Kevin Munch. Ah, on the first one. Kevin Munch bezwingt den Doppelweltmeister Adrian Lewis. Es ist unglaublich. Ein Wahnsinnsauftritt des 29-jährigen Bochumers. Klasse Match, Kevin Münch. Der hier den größten Moment in seiner Karriere erlebt. Und to win the set, he has to get it here. This to stay in the World Championship. Double eight for Barney, gotta get it! Oh, oh no! He's missed five darts! Are we about to witness the biggest shock in the history of the PDC World Championship? Double 16 for the most remarkable victory for a man who nobody had heard of, including Raymond Van Barneveld. One of the biggest shocks of all time in World Championship darts. Raymond Van Barneveld. He's out! It is for the match. It's not out of the question. It would be the top checkout so far this week. It's on. It's on. Double 14. 14s for the match. Oh, Taylor's gone. Taylor is out. The power has been switched off in Dublin in the biggest shot in the history of darts.
from Andy Calaby. Remember the name. Remember the name Calaby. The West Beach Wonder has caused the biggest shock for years and years and years. 20, double 16 for Kirk. Yeah, wins yeah. the young man. Beats Marvel in a blinder. He's in the final. The rookie has done it. Wayne's world falls apart. Kirk Shepard, a virtual unknown, 10 days ago, will take on John part of New Year's Day in the World Championship Final. Wayne came on kissing the officials, but who's giving the kisses now? Our World Finalist Feast Park is Kirk Shepard. I'd have liked to have played better. Didn't play great in the final, but can't take it away from John, worthy champion, but I'll be back. This is just the start of things. It was always going to be tough against a, a champion like John, but there were moments like the 160 checkout to take the seventh set that was must have given you a little bit of hope. Yeah, um, I think the killer point was I started off not great in the game, and John took advantage, and um, and at four nil down against a player like John, it's very hard to get back into it, and. Um, I just didn't start off well, and I think that was the killer point. Just finally with you, um, you're due in the factory tomorrow morning at 8 o'clock. You've got a £50,000 cheque. Are you going to turn up? I don't know. I might pull a few sick days to start, <laughs> but um, probably not, no. Uh, we'll see. We'll see. Ladies and gentlemen, the runner-up, Kirk Shepherd.